hate comments with Mr. Giffa. This is mostly about F1 and my reaction, so get ready. F1 fans hate NASCAR fans, is what I'm saying. Man, you stupid as fuck. X D D. And his pro. Dude, your profile picture looks like you live in your mom's basement and you're 40 years old. You, you don't have room to talk. So dangerous. I could survive all these crashes. Trash YouTuber. <laughs> Roblox channels are better. Lol, 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 lol. Yeah, your mod's gone. No offense, you know nothing about racing. As NASCAR's lo losing fans, and you live it literally race in circles. Yeah. And F1 has more racing than NASCAR. What? Sorry, Mr. Jones. Racing is racing. Anything can be racing. F1 has more racing? Really? Okay. There is dozens of lead changes in NASCAR race. There's like three in F1, so... And you, you can't deny that. Student... Oh, 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 man, this is a juicy one. This dude knows absolutely fuck all. No way in hell NASCAR's... What the fuck are you talking about? No way in hell NASCAR's safer than F1. NASCAR drivers in a fucking... NASCAR drives in a fucking big circle and nothing happens. It takes... Nothing happens. Roll the clip. The track. Johnny Sauter. He won at Daytona <coughs> earlier this year. Can he do it again? <coughs> they wrecked behind him. They're rolling behind him. Now the 88 spins. George Ford is going to win. It's going to be Johnny Sauter that will get the win. Almost, he almost squeezed Harvick into the wall. And here comes Harvick, the 29, with Matt Kenseth. Oh, Mark got loose. Mark got loose. And Harvick's getting a run off turn four. It's going to be a drag race all the way back to the start-finish line. No caution. They're side by side. Right to the line. Here they come, checkered flag. Harvick. Kevin Harvick wins the Daytona 500. Welcome to NASCAR, you dumb son of a bitch. Ryan Newman, February this year. Here comes a push from Denny Hamlin. Oh, this thing's not over yet. Not at all. Ryan Newman off turn four for the final time. Blaney to the outside, oh. to the inside. Here comes Hamlin up the outside. Wow. Crash into the wall, into the air. Up. Goes Newman. Upside down. In a shower of sparks on his roof. Ryan Newman comes across the line, fourth. And Can an F1 driver survive that? Kyle Larson. I can't remember what year it was. Daytona. Regan Smith 7, Keselowski 22, Stewart 33, and contact! Smith turned around, Tony Stewart is going to win this race! And a terrible crash coming to the finish! And this is a big, big wreck. Kyle Larson's car with the front end severely torn off. We'll hope everybody's okay. Can an F1 driver survive that? Austin Dillon, 2015, Coca-Cola 600, Daytona. Dylan Hart Jr. to the bottom of the track. Jr. will win at Daytona. And the big one happens behind them. Oh my God. Austin Dillon into the catch fence. All the crews getting out to that car to assist these drivers. Thumbs going up from all the crew members and the crowd roars. Look at the catch fence on the front straight. 
just pushes the three up into the air enough that it rolls over the top of the car. And then that momentum just continues to move him into the catch fence. Hang on. This will be a wild ride. That was Tony Stewart going underneath the three. Can an F1 driver survive at that? The answer is no. These built like tank cars are way safer than these open wheel, body exposed twig cars. I mean, howdy. Yeah, buddy, it's different. When in NASCAR, you just turn left in four turns a lap. Lamau, these F1 tracks have like up to 30 turns a lap. Like, why do you comment on something you know nothing about? Joshua, Stewart, man. You, you look stupid. First of all, I don't know where you get just turn left. I have no idea where you get that. There's six road courses on the NASCAR schedule, if you didn't know. Of course you don't, because you don't do research. That is clearly grass, dumbass. Yeah, I can see that. Pretty obvious. You will play with me. No. Are you high? That's gonna do it. For the hate comments. Uh, yeah, they're all pretty stupid. I know. They make no sense. Usually how hate comments are. And as I'm getting more viewers, more subscribers, I'm gonna get more. So this ain't gonna be the only one, trust me. I have no idea why all F1 fans hate NASCAR fans. I don't know if they're just salty. But who cares, to be honest. I don't care. We just recently hit 250 subscribers. So that's pretty dope. Pretty dope. Pretty dope. Yeah, that's it. I'm gonna go edit this now.